Uh, next is the Eagles at Cowboys. This will be an interesting game because it is a, a division rivalry game. So Eagles are going to Dallas as underdogs against the Cowboys. Dak Prescott came back to the league right where he left off. Through two games, he is six in total yards. In the first game, the Cowboys only rushed for 60 yards. Last game, they rushed for 198 thanks to Tony Pollard and Zeke. They both gathered a TD that game and so far. Excuse me. They both gathered, gathered a TD so far in the season. Pollard racked up 109 yards last Sunday, so he's, a, he's definitely a threat for the run game. The Cowboys passing game is the most impressive in my opinion. Right now you got Amari Cooper and CeeDee Lamb that are both top five in receptions, which is why Dak has thrown the ball 85 times so far this season. The Cowboys defense is a different story though. The Cowboys D is ranked eighth and the Cowboys D is eighth in run defense, but 31st in pass defense. That's second to worst. Bucks and the Chargers run game is not that impressive to me. So when they go up against like the Panthers or the Vikings, it might be a different story for the Cowboys run defense. But if you throw against the Cowboys, it could get ugly. The Eagles strongest trait is their defense. They have held the Falcons to six points and a good 40 and a good 49ers team to only 17. Their passing defense is the opposite of the Cowboys, though. They are ranked third in that category and only allowed one pass TD so far. And that's actually hard to do, especially against the Falcons. Their run defense is okay. It's middle tier, but they've also only allowed one TD. The Eagles' pass game is medio medio mediocre along with the run game. Jalen Hurts is a second-year quarterback. He's been good. He's had three pass TD three passing TDs against the Falcons and a rush TD against the 49ers. He has wheels and he can run when needed. He has some targets, but not the greatest one, greatest ones. Right now he has Jalen Rager, Devonta Smith, and Dallas Goder. I think Devonta Smith is the best of all three, but Dallas is a good tight end and has averaged 11 yards per reception. So we'll see how the Cowboys hold him um, down. Outside of Hertz, the Eagles have Miles Sanders, who's racked up 129 rushing yards, but I think he's due for a TD. I think this team's offense is not that great right now, but not very efficient at the moment. Overall, I think Dallas will have a passing game that will overthrow the Eagles' great pass defense, but Dak will not throw as well as he against the Bucks. I think he'll get at least two TDs. I do think Zeke and Pollard will have a good showing. I've, I'm going to predict that one of them will score a TD. I think Jalen Hurts will have a season high, at least the same amount of TDs as Zach as Dak, including a rush TD. And the head coach, uh, Nick Sirianni, I think he's a smart guy, but I don't think he'll be ready for an offensive team like Dallas. I predict Dallas will win by seven points.